Oh, we have a little bit of an update. Oh, yeah. As you can see, I am not in the actual editor, I guess. <laughs> this is a recreation where it was left off back in, um, hacked. Hacked. Yeah. Anyway, basically, we have an update, and yeah, I still stand by my statement of a Christmas girl. And especially now that I have other things to add. Because I was thinking, I was thinking about some stuff. And I want to talk about said stuff. So, basically, in this today's episode, or Wednesday's episode, um, inside his castle, the one and only Hitsutaki's castle, you know the one, um, yeah, I was thinking, a year ago, I mentioned, around this time, like, especially after the, um, Christmas Invasion episode, I mentioned that Stampy said something to me, did he not? I asked him a question, like, oh, are we ever gonna find out who Hit the Target's real name is? what Hit the Target's real name is? And well yeah, he said yes. And yeah, like I feel like we're about to get an origin story here. In a Christmas style. Christmas Carol. You see? Hit the target's the standard for Tiny Tim. Or Cratchit. <laughs> Bob Cratchit, you know? You know who I'm talking about. If you don't, oh, well, you should catch up a little bit. Mm. It's a target star standing. And it's a target? Well, you might genuinely be happy. You might genuinely want to be happy and just... He got what he wanted. He got something. Something. Maybe he is happy. That's not necessarily a bad thing. No! That's not a bad thing! Whether or not he is or not, I'm... In this case, I'm not... Feeding you any lies. Just tell you the truth. If the target's happy. You know? Maybe he just genuinely... Cares about what he's doing. Loves what he's doing. Finally gets to do something. Maybe all he wanted was... Find something he was really passionate about, other than taking over the lovely world and stealing Stampy's dogs and the typical villainy stuff. Maybe he doesn't want to be a villain anymore. Maybe he just wants to have fun. Just wants to be himself. Maybe that's what Viva wants too. Just to be happy. Just. Yeah, but Stampy's taking that from them. He is a Scrooge in their lives at this moment, which is perfect, you know? We have everybody here who could be perfect ghosts, past, present, future, helpers, you know? Everybody's here. Everybody. Everything. And maybe Gregory. Could be more. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm just having some fun, but I feel like... I feel like we're gonna get some answers on si on Sunday. You know? I would stay tuned. I would watch the episode. I would I would I would pay attention because if this is right. Stabby never promised me anything. I only asked a question. One question. One question I was really curious about, especially after that conversation. I was all that stuff. Backstory. Yes, we are going to find out his target's real name. His target is not who you think. But maybe that's a good thing. Maybe he's not really the villain here. Not this time. Stubby's really showing that the target was right all along. All along. He was right. Do not trust him. Is that what we want? I don't think so. I don't think that's what Stampy wants. And maybe this Sunday, we'll get to see something special. So, I'd watch his channel. Especially if you're not a Stampy fan. Especially if you're a Hermitcraft or Empires fan. Tune in on Sunday. Please. Give him some love. Give it some love. It's gonna be great. Trust me.
Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. I do hope you enjoyed it. It's just me gushing and getting excited and theorizing and all that stuff. You know, the theorist thing. The fan thing. You know? I haven't talked about the Rift or any other Hermitcraft Empire stuff lately. Especially now that Sausage found the crown. Um, the Hermitcraft crown. <laughs> it was stored in the castle. So, okay. That's cool. It probably isn't cursed or anything. Just men being red. But that's fine. But yeah. I haven't talked about that. Because this. 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 <laughs> this happened. Stumpy. First the crossover takes up the lovely world time. And then the lovely world takes up the crossover time. What is this madness? Stumpy. <laughs> See you guys in the next one. Goodbye.